Australia is a big country, so it's no surprise that one of the most common themes for Australian tourist attractions is big. The big banana, the big pineapple, Australia has these giant statues throughout the country. Now Australia Post has just released a new series of coins and stamps celebrating these Aussie big things, and they've chosen 10 big things to be immortalised, and there's at least one attraction from each state and territory. The 10 coins are, from Queensland, there's the big pineapple, in New South Wales you'll find the big banana, and also the giant blue healer. Victoria has the giant Murray Cod, as well as the giant koala. The big swoop, which is a giant magpie stealing a chip, lives in the ACT. No prizes for guessing which state has the big Tasmanian devil. Then the Northern Territory has the big jumping crocodile. South Australia is home to the big lobster. And Western Australia has the giant ram. And normally when we're talking about coins, ram refers to the Royal Australian Mint, who made these coins. But in this case, it's a giant sheep. These coins have the same memorial obverse, or headside design, as the other $1 coins released into circulation this year. This memorial design of Queen Elizabeth shows the years of her reign and the denomination of $1 under the Queen's portrait. Now the good news is that all 10 coins are going into circulation, so you can find them at face value, unlike the AFL set from earlier this year, which only released two of the coins into circulation and you, you had to buy the rest. However, you can also buy the full set of Big Thing coins if you want to save yourself the headache of trying to find them all in your change. This promotion is similar to previous Australia Post coin promotions. There's a tube you can buy with all of the coins. And of course, there's a folder that comes with the tube to display your coins. Even if you don't store your coins in the folder, these folders make a nice souvenir of these Australia Post coin promotions. As well as these basic coins, there's also stamps, proof coin sets, and PNCs to cater to all coin collectors' tastes. Again, as with previous promotions, one in ten of the tubes has a special coloured coin. This time it's the giant Murray Cod coin that gets the coloured treatment. You can see the difference between the standard and the coloured versions of the coins here on the Mint's website. Now you can also buy the single coins for $3 each in these cardboard wallets, which is basically the same price per coin as the tube. However, if you buy these single coins, make sure to open the wallet in the store and check the coin before you buy it. You can easily pull the coin out and have a look at it. So, in summary, there are 10 new coins going into circulation celebrating famous big tourist attractions throughout Australia. You can buy a tube with all 10 coins, which also gives you a chance at a coloured version of the Murray Cod coin. And whether you buy the tube or the single coin, it works out to about $3 per coin. Otherwise, you can get the coins at face value in your change if you pay by cash at Australia Post. So keep using cash, and good luck in your coin hunting.